The overall goal of this procedure is to assemble various types of polymer encapsulated metal nanoparticles into long chains of HOMO and copolymers. This is accomplished by first synthesizing metal nanoparticles with different sizes and morphologies. The second step is to encapsulate the nanoparticles with polystyrene block polyacrylic acid, or PSPAA, polymers. Next, the polymer encapsulated nanoparticles are assembled into chains by incubating them in the acidic condition. Alternatively, a heteroassembly can be obtained by assembling chains of different nanoparticles. Ultimately, transmission electron microscopy is used to monitor the morphologies of the nanoparticles, the encapsulation of the nanoparticles, and the assembled chains. The main advantage of this technique over the existing method, which usually requires dipole moments for linear assembly, is that it allows not only the formation of homo nanoparticle chains, but also the heteroassembly of different nanoparticles. We have this idea when we first observed the transformation of polymer micelle from spherical to cylindrical upon acid treatment. Begin this procedure with the synthesis of metal nanoparticles, including gold nanoparticles and tellurium nanowires, as described in the text protocol. To encapsulate the gold nanoparticles in PSPAA, first purify the gold nanoparticle solution by adding 3 milliliters of the as synthesized gold nanoparticle solution to two microcentrifuge tubes. Centrifuge the solution at 16,000 times G for 15 minutes and remove the supernatant. Dilute the concentrated solution with 160 microliters of deionized water. Next, prepare the PSPAA stock solution by dissolving 8 milligrams of PSPAA in 1 milliliter of